Got it for us. Hi, Phil. Will Ford and GE Healthcare executives have just ramped up a conference call talking about how many ventilators they plan to be building, and it's a lot. They expect to build 50,000 ventilators in the next 100 days. Initially, they'll be ramping up production at a facility in Florida, but by the week of April 20th, they plan to begin production, mass production, at a plant, a Ford plant just outside of Detroit. They will start that production on the week of April 20th. They'll build 1,500 by the end of April, and again, 50,000. In the next 100 days, those ventilators, by the way, are going to be built by Ford UAW workers who have volunteered uh, to be a part of this. They'll be paid, but they'll be volunteering to be a part of the production process. One last note. You know about the problems between the Trump administration and GM last week where they said they weren't moving fast enough. In announcing that they're ramping up production, the uh, Ford put in a quote from Peter Navarro, who is in charge of the Defense Production Act for the White House. And he says the Ford GE healthcare team is moving in Trump time. That's the term he uses to speed urgently needed ventilators to the front lines. No doubt, Peter Navarro making it clear that they want companies to move quickly, and that's what Ford and GE Healthcare are doing. Guys, back to you.